The world's at a crisis point. We're short of energy in many places. We're facing a crisis of energy affordability in many places. And at the same time, we have this problem called climate change arising from our energy use and particularly our carbon intensive energy use. The energy and climate problem is actually a really complex one. It's often called a wicked problem. You have all these uh, different factors that, that play against each other and trade-offs that need to happen. And so you can't have people who focus only on technology. You can't have people who only focus on policy. We're trying to build a new breed of energy professional. It's rare. There are very few programs like this in the world. It goes almost against the grain of what a, a university typically does. Universities are very good at building experts in specific fields. But this is such a complex problem. What we need are people with breadth, not depth. I work in the minerals and energy industry in economics and the program offers me a broader career path after I finish the program. Still in the energy industry but with a mix of different skills including the engineering and the finance and the environmental science aspects. Exposure to industry stakeholders and government professionals is crucial for anybody who wants to create change in this space. These are the people who already make the decisions on investment, on policy, on regulation. So we need our students to be able to engage and interact effectively with these leaders. It's really um, inspirational when you get expert guest speakers coming in, taking time out of their professional jobs to teach students because they believe in the program and they believe that the students that are in the room will be some of the change agents in the future that are going to be working on this energy challenge. Some of the graduates will go back to their existing careers with additional skills and utilise those skills to become leaders in that space. Others will make career changes and go on to things that we can't even yet imagine as the energy and climate issue and solutions take shape. So as we take this program forward, we see it as being even better, more in touch with the current world challenges and more focused on the current trilemma, the affordability, the reliability versus environmental sustainability.